It is Tuesday the 30th and it's 9 34 a.m. And I wanted to show you guys a week in my life, just bits and pieces of what I do after work or before work. So today I do have a shift. It's 12 to 9. So I have a pretty late shift. So I'm going to like try to get some chores done. I just got my makeup done and I got dressed. And let me show you guys my outfit. This is the outfit for today. I know like you're like, whoa, Amanda, like you're gonna wear this to work. I'm gonna throw a, a sweater on top. Um, and I obviously have um, a shirt for work. So I'm gonna wear that when I get there. But um, this top Amazon and these pants are from Cost. Now this is a little loose because it's too big on me like uh, waist wise but um and it's also droopier because i have my airpods here but i also have my work badge so i feel like it's just dragging it down but and also my slippers are mismatched um it's been a morning and don't ask okay so now what i want to do is i want to get some chores done before i get to work and I also want to go to a little cafe before I go to work because, I don't know, yesterday, I haven't worked out this morning because yesterday um, I worked out with my mom and the day before I worked out with my friend Melissa. Shout out to my mom, shout out to Melissa um, because y'all made me work out and Brian too. My husband, y'all pushed me. Um, so I'm a little like sore um, right now. So I'm like, Mm, maybe I'll treat myself. Maybe I'll treat myself to a little treat um, because I worked really hard. So um, I want to go uh, to a cafe and do that. But before I go, I want to get some chores done. So I'm going to try to like put away some dishes and um, also wash some dishes. You can hear my washer. I don't know if you can hear my washer right now, but it is doing the same thing. Um, and hopefully before I go, I'll put it to dry. Um, because I actually need a work shirt that's in there. All right, so I'm back in my room because the dryer's kind of loud and I'm still waiting for it to dry my work shirt. So in the meantime, I thought I would show you guys what I've recently got in the mail. Um, this, um, I bought it off Amazon. I've tried her multivitamins before, but this is their raspberry flavor. Not my favorite. Not my favorite. I like their strawberry flavor, flavor a lot more, but I love the health benefits of it. So if you're in the market for a vitamin, try them out, um, but get strawberry. And I also got this um soundful journal you guys already know that i've already bought one of their journals before let me grab it i already had this one before and this is just their paperback i bought the hardcover but i feel like i should give this to a friend of mine um i don't know like as soon as i got it i was like no this is for someone else so I kind of want to give it to a friend. So yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. But this here is the hardcover. And it's just, if you guys have never seen this, it's just like a gratitude journal. But it has like biblical affirmations. I don't like particularly using that word, to be honest. I like to say de declarations or something like that because, I don't know. I just don't like that. I don't like that word. But um, I like it. it. It's all like you know it has some of the scriptures in it and you can just write down all the things that you're grateful for it helps you really just like reflect on your day how god has helped you what you learned i don't know i just i love this so much and i'm glad that i got the hardcover but i don't know if i'll buy the hardcover for myself i might i might buy it but i think this one this one belongs to somebody else and i love the back it says it is well with my soul. I also wanted to mention that like yesterday, I feel like I really messed up and like I, you know, did some things that were wrong. And 
I just like, I talked to God about it and I was like, I messed up, you know, and I'm sorry. And I like repented for what I did. And with that, like it makes me feel like far away. I feel, I mean, I, that's how I feel. I feel like far away, but you know, I, I know I don't like go by what I feel. I go by what I know. I have to go by what I know um, because like I got to have faith and um in god's word it says that he will never leave you nor forsake you and that is something that i like holding on to and yeah like i i definitely messed up but i when i go to him like i feel like he just speaks so much kindness he's so kind you know in spite of all of the bad things that i do so i just wanted to say that because if you fumble the bag like I fumbled the bag, <laughs> um, there's hope and there's grace. Um, just go to God and talk to him about it because he's there for you. So yeah, I just wanted to throw that in there. And now I'm just gonna like patiently wait for a shirt to dry and then head out to this cafe. Duncan's really quick because I wanted to get a bagel twist and now we're on to the cafe because I feel like the cafe has a better matcha or better coffee than Duncan's but it has a great bagel twist. So it's later in the day, it's like 11 something right now and I got home, showered, winded down. I made a soup and I wanted to show you guys here and in there is like a little bit of rice. I already had a few bites, it tastes really really good. And right now what I'm doing is I am going through um, my laptop, going through my laptop I am going um, through my video, my, the new one I just posted, I just posted my Miami vlog. If you haven't watched it, I'm going to link it up above. Um, and I also uh, was supposed to do a discipleship class today. Um, if you guys don't know, my church offers a discipleship class where you, a discipleship class is like where you get discipled. Like, I don't know how else to... <laughs> I don't know how else to say that, um, but yeah, we he just like has a packet and he goes through it and like we fill it out and i really really like it because i learned a lot in that class i feel like i really grew in that class and yeah i'm, I'm glad that i'm in there the person hosting the class his name is edgar and edgar was telling me hey there's gonna be a test and but it's open book but you need to have the packet and i i was kind of like just following him along on the classes and i haven't filled out the packet <laughs> all together so i'm gonna go through and also fill out that packet um for next week's class because next week's class is when i have to take a test and i want to pass the test uh so yeah i'm gonna go through and do those things right now and just eat my soup chill relax and then go to sleep
12 um, in the morning and my shift starts at 9 30 um, so I gotta get going because it takes me about one hour to get to work but I want to show you guys really quick um, this morning I read my Bible and I just hurried up and got dressed uh, for the day and then this is the outfit the slippers match this time so we're we're doing better than yesterday I love this. This is kind of like one of my quote-unquote uniforms for work. I just wear like a sweater and jeans. Um, and I have done my makeup for the day. And I braided my hair today um, so that I, it looks a little bit more put together. It's a little frizzy. Um, but maybe I'll add some oil to my hair so it's not like, you know, super frizzy. And now I'm just going to quickly whip up, whip up a breakfast and like get going. Um, I think I might make a smoothie. Um, yesterday my stomach kind of hurt, so I don't know if it was probably breakfast that I ate. But um, today I'm going to make a smoothie to make sure I get some protein because I actually, I don't know if I told you guys, I work in retail, but I work um, in our like back, back room area and I lift boxes and stuff. So I, you know, burn a lot of calories and so I have to make sure I get a lot of protein in. Otherwise, I start feeling really, really sore. Don't ask me how I know. I learned the hard way. <laughs> so um, I'm going to go ahead and whip up a smoothie so that way I can get my protein in. protein powder, spirulina, soy milk. Delicious. So I just got out of work and now I'm gonna go watch my friend get baptized. So I'm here at the entrance um, to the beach because I'm waiting for one of my other friends, that friend that we were waiting for, um, to show up so that I can lead her back to the baptisms. There's only, I think, like four people left um, to get baptized. So we got to hustle. Um, but she said she's only like one minute away, so hopefully we'll make it in time. Um, but we got to run. <laughs> Yes, I did. <laughs> it was so good. Yes. Oh. Are you running? Absolutely. I sprinted. <laughs> I gotta get y'all. It's in cinematic mode. <laughs> Guys, she finally showed up. We finally got her. Oh, it's a video. We're finally on our way. We, I think we're also gonna celebrate um, one of our like church friends' birthday. Yes. Um, Edgar. And we're also gonna celebrate. We're gonna celebrate physical life and spiritual life. Amen. And born again and another year of life. Happy birthday! Oh, wow, 100%. Okay, guys, let's extend our hands and bless his life because he never imagined himself right now in this moment being here. And this is special. So, Father, in this moment, we bless Edgar's life, Lord. We in this moment, Lord, that you're able to bring an acceleration in this new season, Father. You're able to even bring even more revelation. Like <laughs> <laughs> Good morning everyone. So today is Friday. 
it's the following day and it is 10 11 a.m i didn't film yesterday but i'm actually off today and um i'm super excited because i'm gonna get some stuff done so the first thing that i want to get done is i want to go to my friends and drop this off for her i'm super excited before i head out to go with my friends i just want to show you guys the outfit these are leggings from um, Girlfriend Collective. They actually sent me this, but none of this is sponsored. They just were kind enough to gift it to me. And um, I'm wearing my socks and looks like they are almost a pair. <laughs> and I'm also wearing this shirt. It says Alive in Christ. This is from Elevated Faith. Here's the back. And I'll see what I do from there, but I have like a loose idea of what I want to do today. But let's tackle this first and we'll cross the, the other bridges when we get there. Hi! <laughs> Hi! So it's a little bit later in the day. Right now it is 5.08. And um, I dropped off that journal for Melissa and we chatted a little bit. And now I didn't film um, anything until just now. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna go drop I'm gonna go drop off Brian because he is gonna go help a friend move. And I'm gonna go to the cafe to finish editing this video and filling out the packet for my discipleship class, which I have to take a test for. <laughs> it's open book, so hopefully I will pass. It's Monday and I skipped filming Saturday and Sunday um, but those days were kind of busy anyway so I'm glad I skipped but today I wanted to show you guys a little Sephora haul because um, I showed you guys I think on Friday that I had purchased some things from Sephora so I just want to show you guys a little haul number one it's this is wet because I grabbed it from my shower because I already used it um, this is the Brio Briagio um, conditioner and I usually would use their hair mask but I feel like their hair mask was getting a little thick for me so I'm using their conditioner I bought the full-size bottle this time of their color wow um, their uh, what is it dream cocktail kale infused leave-in treatment this is really good especially if you have a split ends um, I really like this and it's like a heat protectant and it activates with heat so I use this when I blow dry my hair and the last thing is they gave me a little sample of this Dior Rouge lip stain. I haven't tried it yet. I, mean, I don't think I've ever tried like a Dior lip stain. I didn't even know they had them, but I can't wait to try it. I can see Brian's leg in the back. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a little flower emoji in the comments if you made it all the way to the end. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. God bless. Bye.